in 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 the history of, of the West, most states had a law where you had to bring your guns to the sheriff when you came into town, uh, and he held them till you left town. There was obviously good rationale back then for this. And there's good rationale today. We live in a major metropolitan uh, area. Uh, we have four and uh, two others rising in the state of Tennessee. Uh, I also have a concern with tourism. Uh, as you're aware, in my district, I have Opryland, the convention center. Uh, I don't know, have you checked on how tourism has been negatively affected uh, in, in, in states that have passed such uh, constitutional carry? I have not checked, but I would argue that uh, folks carrying weapons uh, is necessary to protect other folks. Um, I, I don't think that there would be a, um, a increase in crime just because folks are carrying. You have mentioned the Wild West as well as Representative Jones. Um, well, again, 30 of the states of our union allow for this open carry of firearms constitutionally. Six of the eight states around the state of Tennessee allow for the open carry of firearms, and it's not the Wild West in Colorado in any of these states. So that would be my, my answer. Okay, and... Uh, it, it, Georgia passed this last year, correct? I don't know. They did. Georgia was and one of the two that I, that I, I th knew last year was not one of them. One and uh, since then, Atlanta's lost major uh, conventions. Uh, we've got, it's a billion dollar industry here in Middle Tennessee. I know it is in East Tennessee and in West Tennessee. We want to grow it to over a billion and a half. Uh, the hospitality has told me that this will uh, make, uh, will hurt the, the tourism industry, and I just can't, um, in any shape, form, or fashion, see where this is necessary. And, oh, I wanted to add that last year, Metro had a 50-year low in homicides. That's going back to when it was first found in 1962, and we're not carrying guns out there. Walk out on the street, there's nobody with a gun, and we, we had fewer homicides than we did in 1962. So how is open carry going to make us safer in this city? 